Okay, so first off, break these things loose. <clears throat> there we go. This is an impact driver, by the way. And uh, it's got left and right. So right now I have it set on, uh, let's see. I have it set on left, which is counterclockwise. Right is clockwise, right? So I got them popped loose, might as well take them out. Keep it on left and, uh, and screw them right out. When you put it back in, put some Loctite on it. Because this is what holds the uh, disc on, or the rotor on, besides the uh, caliper. All right. Next, break the caliper loose. Yeah, they're getting down there, all right. Huh. Wow. Wow. See the little metal tab here is right. Uh, making noise, I bet. <laughs> yep. They were ready to be changed, no doubt about it. This one here wasn't down to the, well, I guess it was right there. You can see it right even. This metal tab's even with the uh, pad. So, yep, both bad. Well, we'll squeeze this caliper in. light on it so you can see it and just take it easy you know it's going in easy I don't have to force it at all They say to take the uh, cap off uh, of the brake deal. I've never had to do that. As long as you don't, you know, go crazy on this, you shouldn't have to. You just take it slow, wind it in till it's all the way in.
Feels like it's all the way there. All right. There we go. Now, it's best to, uh, I say to tie this thing up, but it uh, doesn't look like I need to. It sits right here, pretty nice. You just don't want it hanging by the hose only. It's, uh, yeah, it, uh, it'll start leaking if you do that. Now let's pull this rotor off. like that and uh, hmm Well, the front pad, these are for your uh, emergency brakes. That's all this is for. And this one here is, well, I guess it's, it's thicker than I thought. So, I still have pad on it. So they're okay. All right. I probably need to get new ones eventually, but uh, there we go. Well, put the new rotor on. Hey, Ding. Good. In case it has any uh, oil on it. Okay. 
Yep. Just a little Loctite on it. Okay. Next group. Loctite. This is a 271 Loctite. It's what I use on mostly everything. <laughs> that requires Loctite. Stuff that uh, is critical that you don't want back and back out on its own. I use Loctite on it. Or areas that have high vibration. Okay, then a little wrap with a hammer. Just, won't, you know, not overdo it. Just enough to make sure it's, uh, and push it all the way up and then hit it. Okay. Push it all the way in and hit it. All right. So those two are on. Now it's time for the uh, brake pads disc. These are the uh, the keepers. I'll have to pull the old ones out. Okay, so there's two of those and four of these. All right. So, first of all, that's already got the uh, plate on it, and this one has the plate on it already, so, uh, so, there you go, so.
Okay, let's get the light over here. Alrighty. <clears throat> so. So, the new pieces. There we go. Just like that. <clears throat> Got the new piece up here on that one. If you can see it. This piece goes like that. Okay, like that. Like that. Put these two. Ah. this <clears throat> okay fold this over like that Okay. Put a little grease on this one. Start it anyway. Just around the shank. Okay. Okay grease on this one around the shank just like that push this down kind of spring loaded <laughs> good enough <clears throat> then got the caliper bolts these guys put your backup wrench there's two nut uh, there's there's this part of it and you put the open end on and then you get on this and then you tighten, tighten that up For tightening you know, both of them up totally, make sure you get this one going first. Okay. 
Okay. And tighten them. <clears throat> Basically holding the the outer one and using the nut tighten it just like that. Now we gotta tighten the uh, caliper bolts with the uh, breaker bar. Okay, and then the bottom one. There we go. Sometimes this uh, piece here gets bent and it'll scrape your uh, drum. So if you see that, push it back out so it's not rubbing. The only thing that's touching now is the, uh, the pads. So we're good. Same thing on the other side. And so anyway, we're going to throw the wheels back on and... Uh, the uh, new uh, disc and rotors are on. We're good to go. All right. So you like the video, please subscribe, leave comments, and uh, uh, hit that notification dingling bell and leave me a like. Thanks.